Today I want to speak about the false concept of black identity. Blackness as a culture and identity is a myth. It was brought about during the early days when boundaries and borders were drawn in Africa. Before all this, Africa was predominantly black, but they did not bond over their blackness. They fought each other as various tribes. Even now one group will slaughter hundreds of thousands with machetes in a few days. Be proud of your individual African tribe, but this idea of blackness or African is myth. Understand that there is no pride in simply being black. The things that groups like the NAACP and black leaders are saying only serve to divide the people, not unite them. Down with the black nationalist culture on the continent of Africa, and black pride in America, I agree. Asian culture and identity is a myth too. It was brought about only recently when various people from the continent of Asia moved to a European country and are trying to unite against the native European people to receive benefits and special rights and privileges. Throughout history various countries in Asia have had brutal wars with each other. We don't even have to go back past WW2 to see how Japanese and Chinese treat each other. But then they move to Australia or America, and they want to pretend they are one united Asian culture and people. One nation would wage war with another nation for control and territory. Be proud of your individual Japanese or Chinese identity, but this idea of Asian is a myth, and they should admit it's a myth. Understand that there is no pride in simply being Asian. The things that Asian American interest groups and Asian leaders are saying only serve to divide the people, not unite them. You are so right. This is true for Hispanics, too. Hispanic as a culture and identity is a myth. It was brought about only recently when they are trying to unite against white people and invade their nations. Before all this, South America was Hispanic, but they did not bond over their Hispanic identity. They fought each other as various tribes. Even now one gang or tribe will slaughter men, women and children from another tribe in the battle for control and territory. Be proud of your individual Hispanic identity, like being from Argentina, but this idea of Hispanics United is myth. Understand that there is no pride in simply being Hispanic. The things that groups like La Raza and Hispanic leaders are saying only serve to divide the people, not unite them. Down with the Hispanic nationalist culture in South America, and Hispanic pride in America. What about the false concept of Indian culture? Native American culture and identity is a myth. It was brought about only recently when they are trying to unite against non-Indian people and receive benefits and special rights and privileges. Before all this, there were hundreds of Indian tribes, but they did not bond over their Native American identity. They fought each other as various tribes. War was viewed as necessary in a way of life. All men were warriors. One tribe would wage war with another tribe for control and territory. Be proud of your individual Indian identity, like being from the Sioux tribe, but this idea of Native Americans united is a myth. Understand that there is no pride in simply being Indian. The things that Native American interest groups and Indian leaders are saying only serve to divide the people, not unite them. Down with the Native American nationalist culture and Native American pride in America. I am glad we have had this discussion. I wonder if we could go on a speaking tour and make a career out of these speeches, like Tim Wise does with his anti-white tour? This is a great idea, but I doubt it would be tolerated.